Hello friends, welcome to Penos.in. In this video, we are going to see a short review on Oliver 181 Silver Cap and Turquoise Blue Body Fountain Pen. And here, this video is specifically taken to give you the clear insights on the pen because just with photos, you cannot fully understand about this. So this is a blue color body and a silver color cap, which has a same similar uh, body's color on the top of this cap. And... Uh, round metal thing which is giving a more decent look to this pen and a golden color clip a parkes model arrow clip and totally this is like a this is resembling this pen is totally resembling a, like a parkes model and here the branch name oliver and the models number 181 was mentioned in this body of this pen let me open this the cap held on the body with a threading mechanism this is thread type 1 and this is number 5.5 nib which has a medium tipped gold plated one and in the nib it is mentioned as oliver 100% steel bico bico is hidden in this grip portion so here it is mentioned but and you can swap the nibs as well like since we have number 5.5 nibs in many brands and especially in can right we are having in fine medium broad and again with gold dual tone and silver pleated nibs and also flex nibs can be swapped in this pen that also in the can right can right brand can right kanpur writers are named for their nibs and yeah for that you can go to our site click pen spares then go to nibs and there you can use a filter and make a query on what you require now to the measurement The holding area's diameter is 8.9 mm and the body is 10.9 mm. The length of the spin without cap is 118.1 mm. With cap it is 133.5 mm. And yeah, with this measurement you can get some idea about the pouches for this pen. If you maintain this properly using pouches and all, the same aesthetic shininess will last forever. And pouches are most important thing for any fountain pens. And let me show you the entire weight of this pen. It is 15 grams. And yeah. the ink filling system here is an eye dropper one whenever you fill the ink in the barrel fill below the inner threads if you fill in excess the leakage path will create it and will spoil your hands and also please apply silicone grease or vaseline in the grip portion during the ink fill whenever you are opening uh, this grip portion for the ink fill because it will create uh, give a long life for your thread portion the smooth Red opening and also as the barrel is a bigger one means the uh, ink filling the reservoir capacity is more so you can fill more than 3 ml of inks in this barrel and on pen maintenance please wash the pens regularly that is twice a month because all the dye based ink will precipitate on the longer usage so it will block the ink's passage in the feeder so you will get a scratch writing and slowly the ink will dry quickly and then you may have to shake the pens for the ink flow to come out the reason is the blockage in the feeder screw so to clean the dirts and deposits in the feeder you can easily remove this feeder and the nib together uh, by holding this together and twist and pull it out after removing you can press the feeder with the help of any brush or clean it well with soap water if you are soaking in soap water then allow it for an hour and brush and clean and in some ink bottles itself you can notice on every fill it is recommended to clean the pen with water so it is clear unless otherwise we have good cleaning and maintenance the flow will be affected and also few nibs need to be fine tuned because during the manual assembly of nibs the tines may stick together so gently push the tines up and down so it will create some space in between the tines so you will get a smooth writing and a very good ink flow in turn 
then whenever we dispatch the pens to our customer we do this fine tuning and we will check before dispatch this is our usual practice and let me give the writing sample of this pen with our penhouse emerald green ink seems to be a fine writing yeah a smooth fine writing it is oliver pens and nibs are highly recommended thing for the beginners if your children is just going to start with fountain pen they can highly prefer this oliver pens and nibs if they started practicing with this they can ha uh, they will have a very good handwriting in uh, in any fountain pens so we are recommending oliver pens so yeah if you have any query about this pen you can ask in the comment section or else you can make a call to our mobile number thanks for watching this video thank you